Hi, I'd like to welcome everyone to another known issue with AquaWare 4. And this has to do with custom intents not working correctly. Um, so I'm going to go through this from start to finish so you really understand what's going on. So under the advanced features tab, um, we're going to create a custom intent session. And I'm going to do this wrong to show you what happens. So under upload image, we're just going to grab an image. Okay. And this is what's important. When it says save as, it defaults to a directory where Aquaware is programmed to look for this. And this is where you should always save any images in your custom intent feature. But um, for demonstration purposes to recreate this particular issue, we're going to go to the desktop and we're just going to save it there. Okay. The first thing you're going to notice is that the image is not populated in the custom intent session. So here we're just going to just run through this quickly. We're going to place some dots. What you're going to notice is now when I go to nucleate this image, we're going to get an error message. Or sometimes you don't, depending. But will, what will happen is this time around, it's going to not nucleate the intent that we created. So water prep user prep each will run for 22 seconds which is fine now again this is by design the images that you save uh, are automatically open up to the directory by default where they should be saved and in a second I'll show you where that is Okay, so this is the exception we're looking for. It can't find the image to load it, okay? Or sometimes it will load the image and nothing will actually run on the screen in the background. So here we're going to exit out of AquaWare. And to quickly fix this problem, we're going to bring up Windows Explorer. And by default, the images are saved in the C drive, users, your name or whatever account you're logged in as. Okay, and for here, there's a hidden directory called app data. So you just put an app data, hit enter, and it'll bring you the next level down. You want to go into roaming, and here you're going to see an Aquaware directory. Now within here, there is a user image directory, and you'll notice that there's no images in there, especially the one we just created. That's why Aquaware is not function, functioning accordingly. So to simply correct this problem, we're just going to delete the user image directory, and then we're going to bring back up Aquaware. So just again, you'll notice that the path is users, the, the account you're logged in as, the hidden profile app data roaming Aquaware and then the folder um, that we just deleted user images okay so we're going to fire Aquaware back up and we're going to create this again and then you'll see how the functionality should be so under advanced we go to upload image grab any image we want okay again if you'll notice that the default area where it's saved is users Peter app data roaming aquaware user images this is where we want to save everything and you'll notice that it gets loaded correctly in the custom intent session We'll say save. We'll place some dots. Nucleate. And we'll let it run through the intent. Again, this really isn't an issue with the software so much as educating yourselves on some of the advanced features. And again, um, Aquaware has very specific points where these images need to be saved. And as long as you follow that rule of thumb, you'll never have a problem. So after user prep, it'll go right into running the uh, intent session perfectly. So again, water prep runs for 22 seconds, user prep runs for 22 seconds, and then 
uh, your intent will run for 44 seconds. And there we go. Okay? Thank you.